it's been a quite an extraordinary 10 years, and I have to say at this particular point since May, I keep, you know, with bin Laden's death, my father died just before uh, September 2001, I think of this extraordinary 10 year period, which has been so grave uh, for the world and, and um, turbulent in Canada in other ways, and miss uh, his point of view with regards to so many subjects there. Um, I would love to know what he would have thought and what he would have made of um, of Stephen Harper, of uh, so much of Gilles Duceppe, but also of the situation in Israel and, and Palestine and the Middle East and or even this year's Arab Spring. Um, he was one of the few writers that I can think of as somebody who's written about novelists in Canada um, who comfortably spanned the worlds of uh, fiction and essay writing. And uh, as his old uh, chum Bill Weinshaw has just pointed out, I had enormous courage, you know, was not afraid of anybody. I mean, in Quebec he's remembered less so now, but for having caused such a stir. But in truth, he pissed off Edmonton and Niagara and the like just as much. Um, in terms of uh, novel writing in Canada, I mean, I think a couple of things. One is, um, you know, my father was, did want to make a point of recording a particular time and place, and through that time and place, which was Montreal, uh, spoke about much greater things. Um, and it is true that the, the world for a writer was different then, and that you could probably come along more than you can now. I mean, it still took my father two or three novels to get going. And thank God he was able to get going. It's, it's a more ruthless, but also, uh, in some ways, easier world in which to write at the moment. I have people come up to me and share uh, stories about my father, um, as I suppose others would if my father was the head of a garment company. You know, um, and But, you know, there have been these books written about uh, my father and Charlie Foran's biography recently, which was very good. And so um, I feel touched and flattered and, um, I mean, uh, that I'm able to learn all of this. And beyond that, just feel part of the community of people who's lost a parent.